God rest. God rest. Have a good night. I cannot believe how green this is. I made a point to come out here to the mountains and hills because look how green it is. It is absolutely insane. California during the rainy season, one of the best because you know we're dry. I couldn't tell you that I couldn't feel more inspired than I do right now. Change of scenery looks different than how it normally looks. Normally it looks brown. So I cannot really complain. Check this bad boy out. Big boy waterfall, green moss, big trees. Heck yeah. Now. Let's keep going. All right. Woo! I I only learned how to skip rocks about four years ago. Rock number 10. That was terrible. Oh, almost fell. Nope. What I've learned from a buddy of mine who taught me how to skip rocks about four years ago now, I think. Give or take three, four years ago. He said you gotta get low and you gotta flick. Low and flick. All right, here we go. Two. Oh, that was terrible. Oh, three. There we go. I'm not the most skilled at skipping rocks. If this one doesn't skip at least two times, I think that's it. I'm officially cannot be a pro skip skip rocker, rocker of skips. I don't know what you call it. All right, I'm just gonna try it. Whoops. All right, here we go. Slow and steady wins the game. Gotta get low, look at a wrist. Low and look at a wrist. Two, baby, two. Let's go. What the heck was this YouTube video even supposed to be about anyways? That's right. Getting out of a creative funk. Getting out of a creative funk. You know, there was this one time I was working on a project multiple days. I could tell you honestly that I put a lot of work into it and it did not turn out the way I wanted to because I felt like my creativity was not there. It, my vision wasn't coming to life how I pictured it. And I just felt like I could not nail what I wanted to do on the screen. So I scrapped it all, every single bit of it started a hundred percent over. But the crazy thing is, crazy. all it took was to change my scenery, grab my camera and document the moment I was truly in and immerse myself, truly be here in the moment to jumpstart my creative juices again. That's all it took. I've had, I've had many creative blocks and for me to find inspiration in some of the most unexpected places, I'm just at a random lake right now. To me, that's amazing. The sun finally came out. Just a mental note, if you're catching the sunrise in the mountains, if you're right by the hills and the mountains and you know it's early morning, the sun's probably not actually going to show for at least an hour after the sun has already risen. And that's the thing though, after a creative vlog, being just in a funk, some of your most extraordinary ideas, that's when they come. Because I know when my creativity is not flowing, I tend to not feel motivated. And when you don't feel motivated, it's because there's usually a lack of action. You have to create the motivation by taking steps towards those goals. And when you take steps towards those goals, you build those motivational feelings and then your creativity comes back. Don't forget, if your creativity isn't there today, it can always be there tomorrow, but you have to take action. It's not gonna just come back on its own. So right now I'm filming on my phone. Beer is not as important as the story you're trying to tell. Again, thank you guys for watching and stay until the end. I hope you guys 
enjoyed this video and took some insightful information from it. And I look forward to seeing you on the next one. I'm hoping to post more on here. I really want to give back to other filmmakers and aspiring creatives to get better because other people have helped me and I want to help you. See you in the next one.